the, really the concept started in trying to put this in motion back uh, during the 2017-18 season towards the end of it. Something we always wanted to do was to find a spot and, and to find an artist to put um, uh, our touch on that and put that up here in Tucson uh, with our own mural. It really became an opportunity to have a contest to partner uh, with the Southern Arizona Arts and Cultural Group here, SACA. We partnered with them to get the word out, to really make it a contest to where uh, a grant was going to be given to the winner with the one with the best vision, the best idea. So I've worked with SACA for a few years now. They sent me actually the call for artists from the Tucson Roadrunners. Alejandra was uh, one of the few finalists that we ended up uh, narrowing it down to. Met her in person, did an interview with her, and it, she, she knocked us out. Her design was fantastic, it was exactly what we were looking for. So I wanted to create, uh, like I said, something really special for children, but also something for adults to enjoy. Well, the Boys and Girls Club of Tucson and the Roadrunners have been partners since day one. What they provide to families and to children is really outstanding. And we are always looking to partner with them and find ways that we can kind of lend our expertise in the sports and entertainment world. With the mural project that we did on the box, it was really cool. Not, not only does it have a feel of what the community in Tucson is all about, it fits in perfectly with Tucson and what we're all about. Another element that I really wanted to include was something for the children from the Boys and Girls Club to be able to participate and feel like they were part of this, this project and the children were able to paint them. Alejandra was really great with working with our kids and just let them kind of do what they wanted to do. You know, she kind of gave them some direction, but let them kind of have a little bit of freedom to, to paint what they wanted to do. To hopefully encourage any of those children that would want to pursue a career in art, that it is definitely possible and it's a beautiful career to have. But having this piece next to the clubhouse, it's great because it's eye-catching, so it brings more attention to us as well, which is great. Alejandra is now a part of the Tucson Roadrunner family forever, uh, whether she wants to be or not. Uh, she is here with us. Uh, she's going to be a, a part of many things that we do in the future, and we really want to celebrate this great project and how awesome everything turned out. So we're looking forward to welcoming Alejandra to a Tucson Roadrunners game during the 2022-23 season. We're very excited to welcome her to a game and to celebrate the project.